hi guys so come back to my channel technology and today in this video tutorial i'll show you guys how to fix microsoft edge browser is showing can't reach this page problem so you just need to follow me so at first you just need to check your dns server for that you just need to go to your start or search window and type ncpa.cpl which is the command for to open a network connection window now here you just need to right click on your ethernet adapter or wi-fi adapter which is uh, which you have connected now i will right click ethernet adapter because i have connected through ethernet so right click go to properties then you just need to double click on ipv4 address okay internet protocol version 4 so double click on it so if you have set any dns server then back up the dns server and I use the new DNS server which I'll give you on my video description which is Google DNS which is 8.8.8.8 and 4.2.2.2 okay after that click on OK and click on OK once it will done you just need to go to your start window and type CMD now right click on command prompt and click on run as administrator after that you just need to type this command which is called ipconfig space slash flush DNS after that press enter once it will done you just need to check your uh, problem is solved or not uh, if still your problem is there then follow my next step you just need to go to your start window and type inet cpl.cpl this command will help you to open internet properties now after open internet properties you just need to click on connection then click on LAN setting and check if you if you have enabled any proxy server so here is my proxy server so I will disable this one and click on OK after that click on apply then OK and check if your problem is solved or not if it's not then I will suggest you to reset and clear your browsing data for that you just need to click on three dot button beside of your uh, Microsoft Edge browser and go to settings after that click on privacy and security from your left side and on your right side you will get an option under clear browsing data you will get choose what to clear so click on that now here I will uh, click select here all time from the drop down and I will check uh, browsing history download history cookies cache and uh, I will click on clear now after done check if your problem is solved or not if it is not then reset your edge browser for that you just need to click on research settings from your left side on your right side you will get a restore setting the default values so click on that and click on reset and after that it will fix your problem so i hope this tutorial will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any questions or questions then comments down below i will see you guys in the next one next video Till then, bye-bye, take care.